And we heard some really disturbing statistics today about, about mental health when it comes to kids and teenagers. Now, County Supervisor Tara Lawson Reamer says the county gets a lot of uh, funding from the state and from the federal government for mental health care, uh, but it's not specifically earmarked for children. And she says that needs to change. There is a growing and intense need for behavioral health services for children and young people. As a parent, and in my conversation with other parents, there is strong consensus about the lack of easily accessible mental health and addiction treatment resources for kids. What I've learned is not just anecdotal. There's data to back it up. And she uh, says, according to a study by the group Children Now, California ranks last in the country when it comes to accessing mental health care for young people. Uh, so she was joined today by several experts, including a doctor at Rady Children's Hospital, uh, who really talked about the need for early intervention. Uh, that studies show the earlier you can catch mental health issues with kids and address them, the better chance they have down the road. Now, Supervisor Lawson Reamer will propose the county develop a framework uh, that really focuses on expanding mental health care for kids kids, dedicates resources to it. Uh, now back to that doctor from Rady's today. Here's what else she told us. Rady Children's has seen a 1,700% increase in emergency room visits in mental health crisis in children. In California from 2016 to 2020, anxiety or depression in children increased by a staggering 70%. And sadly, she says uh, suicide is the second leading cause of death for adolescents. Uh, as for Supervisor Tara Lawson Reamer, she will be proposing or making this proposal to the board next week at one of their meetings. Uh, she says the goal is to have a framework in place within the next six months uh, and a more finalized version within 18 months. Kelly Hessett, CBS 8.